All right, I think we're ready to go here. So, uh, like the title I put in there, um, we're gonna go uh, do some dungeons. So the dragon's gonna start out doing the dregs today, and then we're gonna go. We gotta go gather uh, silver stone and gold stone to make some alchemical base because uh, alchemical base is like the main thing that I need in order to start making like really good armor, and then I can get a uh, map room down. And I could probably like just go and try to get tier three. Um, Bearers, they sometimes drop uh, alchemical base, but I'm not gonna bother with doing that. We're just gonna go farm it. So uh, I'm all ready to go here. Got everything ready to go. Um, we're gonna start out so right here. We're gonna go over to the dregs over there, and then after that, we're gonna go around and go up to Supper Maru, which I haven't even been to yet. Up here, lay down a wheel of pain. Maybe uh, see if there's some decent thralls there for a few minutes. And then from that, uh, go to collect a bunch of silver stone. There's a little, like, the scorpion queen, like, cave is over there. So uh, we're going to hit that up, get silver stone, and then from there, head up to the uh, volcano and grab a bunch of gold stone. So pretty much uh, ready to go here. I got uh, everything that I really need on our thrall. Uh, I got some master weapon repair kits so we can repair um, basically, like, my sword and my uh, pickaxe if it runs out of durability. But, uh, yeah, we are going to go ahead and take off. Before I do that, though, I'm going to send these just follow. I'm going to do this first. I have 10 extra points remaining. So I'm going to uh, just get full corruption here by doing this and then uh, corrupt 10 points into authority. So let's just got to do like this animation here. Alright, so we got heavy corruption, right? So this is what I have to do here to uh, corrupt our stats. I gotta put one point into it and then corrupt it. One point. Oh. Right. Boom. Actually, I need to do this twice, I believe. It's okay. That's why I need to do it, uh, because I need the soul essence. You need the soul essence to corrupt. Boom. And, okay, so we're going to need, let's see, let's just corrupt all the way up to 10. Boom. This really doesn't matter. We need just uh, some more soul essence, which, there are, there are uh, some thralls right over here. There's some NPCs, we can just go knock those dudes out. Check in. OBS quick art. I think we're good. Let's just knock this. Let's just knock the skull out right here. Yeah, took like two swings. Okay. Bring her back. See how like we're like super corrupted now. Quick. Okay, boom. We're on there. I'm gonna make another one of these. I wish we could like speed this up a little bit. So we have five more soul essence so we can uh, corrupt it more. And here we go, this flesh bond, that's what I was going for. Damage taken by you split between you and your followers. So uh, follower, followers will take 50% of my damage. Now I can just go over to our dancer. And it will get rid of this uh, corruption. And it'll get rid of a lot of it. I'll still, I'll still have corruption just because I've corrupted 10 points into authority. So I'll be a, I'll have a little bit of corruption going, but not that much. It'll just be light corruption. Is that medium? Yeah. So yeah, that's how much. So that's how that works. It's gonna 
it's I can't go any more corruption. I can't get up any more than that because I have corrupted basically half of my points into authority. We got that figured out though. So do let's get our buffs going. Just the super simple favor of Ryog and Elixir Freedom. Let's head on down to the dregs. So this uh, dungeon, this should, just, should, this should just be like super duper quick. That looks like a corrupted shale back right there. Which is sweet. Yeah, you can see, I, I don't think I had like, uh, I crafted all star metal tools and stuff. I did some grinding in between, but it was all just boring grinding stuff. I do have like, I do have like star metal uh, tools and weapons now though. That shellback just got wrecked. Okay, I'm just gonna drop this junk that I don't need. I'll just put the steam blood on the horse. Yeah, just uh, got star metal tools and star metal weapons with that star metal yeah, that I uh, got from last time. I'm not going to bother with any of these uh, guys over here. Yeah, so I got star metal tools. I guess I didn't really explain that. Because I've, I've been grinding a little bit off of... Uh, off of the stream, but I also upgraded my uh, those workbenches back there. Upgraded it to the uh, the garrison the armors bench, the gar and the garrison blacksmith bench, and as well as like the precision carpenters bench. Those benches basically have the amount of materials that you need to craft items, which is like really useful. But so I just grinded a little bit to uh, to get those in there too. So we have those now. I still have an upgrade, but I should probably upgrade them for my furnaces. I haven't even, I haven't upgraded those at all yet. We're just gonna run straight through here. I'm like way more powerful than all these Darfari bums. Failed, so uh, I guess I'll just take it still. Okay, so I'm gonna need a, need a bow for this. Already uh, prepared though, ready to go. I'm gonna get the torch out. All right, so let's do this one. This is like this was the first dungeon that they uh, introduced into the game. It was pretty sweet. When they uh, first introduced this, I think the the reptile armor too. That was like, I think that was one of the first uh, different armors that you could craft. That and like hyena, the hyena armor. Besides like your basic light, medium, and heavy armor that they first had. Looks like a little puzzle. 
to hit these things. This should fill up with water. Yep. Okay. that thing. Just can't see if there's one over there. No. Yeah. Alright, so my adventure is not. That one, I think there's uh okay, so there's one on this side and then there's one on this side. Okay, swim over here. Get this one. Fills up. Come on. Get up here. There we go. Alrighty. I think there's some bros in here. Should we, we should be like way more powerful than these guys. Yeah. There we go. A couple of skeleton bros in here. like our bear leveled up. What's our uh, health at? 19. So I played ahead, and I uh, but I just did a different save. And uh, the one that I was doing for that, my bear ended up getting like man, like four, almost 15,000 HP. It was crazy. She got the redeemed trait for her second one, which is plus 15 to health. It's nuts. I'm like super lucky. I gotta go all this way. I didn't get that lucky on this one, I guess. That's crazy, man. Bears are awesome. They can get like tons of tons of uh, HP. That's yeah, actually gonna grab some of this uh, whatever this crap is. We can goop. Grab a little bit of it. Um, we jump. All right. All right. So we gotta go. Uh, we gotta hit this one. The long shot. Let's do this. Bonk. She got it. Go up this way. Yep, it's filling up. Come on. What in the world's going on here? Bruh. Yeah, it's kind of like wonky sometimes. Just gotta wait till it fills back up again. There we 
go. Alright, so we're almost there. Skeleton bro. Take out this guy too. Alright. I'm just gonna go in here and let's get our buff back, okay. So this guy should uh I don't know, should like there there we go, that's what we're waiting for. Just gonna run around the circle and circle going to town. Dude, like this is like we're like way more powerful than this dungeon right now. So just totally wrecking this thing. Should be dead the next time. It's gonna run around the circle. Okay, it's got kind of hurting the horse a little bit, but nah, it'll be okay. So this thing will be dead. All right, there we go. How many uh, abysmal fangs did I get? Forty-six. All right, that's pretty cool. So we got herpetology. So now we can craft the uh, reptile armor. Pretty neat. Reptile armor, I think it gives a decent stamina boost. You could do it like a craft it with a tier four thrall and get like a plus seven, I think. Plus seven stamina boost for each uh, item that you craft. Alright, so we got that down. Now let's head over to Sepamaru. Put a wheel of pain down, probably like. Do a couple of runs through the city, see if we can get something decent. And then go to that, uh, the Scorpion Queen mine. Mine a bunch of silver stone. It's nice on the way back, too. You don't gotta, like, the, the traps, or whatever, the little, like, puzzle. The water levels keep on, like, going up and down, so you don't gotta, like... Do that again. I was thinking about like doing a playthrough where I just immediately do this dregs dungeon like immediately but I don't think uh, with like a, I don't know you might luck out and get like an iron pick from like a drop from uh, one of the NPCs or something but if you just harvest that with the uh, harvest that abysmal remnant with a stone tool like you're gonna get hardly any low what's up Richard Hernandez what is up you know what I'm saying like if you har harvest still like a stone tool, you're gonna get hardly any abysmal thaw fangs, and that's what you need to get craft the actual armor. So I mean like I don't know, I mean to make a full set without I mean with like a basic armor's bench, that's like fifty abysmal fangs. Okay, abysmal flesh, we'll put in there then the fangs. These two, I guess, we'll put in there too. 
Don't need the uh, torch now. Get out of here without having to deal with all these bombs. All right, there we go. Sneak on out of here. And I don't, I don't think I've hit the. Uh, I haven't attuned my bracelet to this obelisk yet, so we'll do that quick. Can like make it up there. Come on, man, make it up there. I think I got the stamina to do it. Let's go. Can do it. Alright, nice. Okay. Boom. Tuned a bracelet. Okay, it's gonna, ah uh, man, it's gonna like throw me all the way down here. Where's the horse at? Here we go. Alright, let's head on over to the, uh, then over to Sepamaru. Map room. This is the uh, death wall. city right there should be like pretty quick getting there it's not that far from here especially with the horse oh, that rock hit my horse that was funny I never had that happen Bunch of iron stone over here. So if you got a base over here, like, yeah, there's iron stone all over here. I used to have, like, a little base right up there on an official server. When Cone Exhaust first came out. Probably, like, summer of 2017. I was, like, the only person playing on that server. It was totally dead. That was when you couldn't climb, too. Imagine playing now and not being able to climb on anything. A bunch of rhinos over here. Not a bunch. There's, 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 I think the savannah has more. That's where we're going for uh, some silver stone right back there. But let's check out the city first. See if there's any, like... Decent NPCs. I haven't even been here yet. And yeah, what do we got? And it's nice because uh, none of the uh, none of these thralls over here or NPCs over here are hostile toward you, unless you like you know mess them. But it's nice. There's uh, okay. I got a named alchemist. Alchemist. Is that worth knocking out? Cook. Is this walking around? Dancer. I kind of want to get this named Alchemist, to be honest. It's just, uh, how am I going to go about it? How am I going to go about, like, Dealing with it because it's, be, it's gonna pull a lot of dudes. Yeah, okay, what are we gonna do here? Uh, let's uh, YOLO. Let's see who, who else we all pull in. It's gonna be like six dudes, I think. If I just like keep the fight over here though, okay, 
Where's Zara? It's not that one. It's the chick. It's kind of like. Okay, it's a mar. It's a marathon. Okay. It's a marathon, not a sprint. So just gotta be careful. So some of them could like go after my thrall. That would be cool. Okay, let's. Okay, that's the alchemist that we don't want to kill, but definitely want to take out the rest of these losers. Okay, I'm kind of like whacking her a little bit, that's alright though. As long as I just, just want to take out these other bombs. Okay, that guy's down. Almost. Let's back off a little bit. Nope, targeted her. Uh, okay, this guy's almost dead. Yeah, he's dead. Hold up. Let's get her buff back. Okay, got some wax on her. Yeah, she's going down. Okay, she's dead. Didn't want to hit her. Alright, this guy's almost dead too. Alright, now I'm just gonna make sure we don't uh, kill her, which, which should be okay. Yeah, I think we'll... It's just, it's just doing pretty minimal damage to her. You got a freaking name thrall. Is this a continuation of your regular gameplay or a new playthrough? It's a continuation from the last one. There, Richard Hernandez. Yep. Continuation from the last one. I just did a little off-camera grinding, like off off-stream grinding, which is why I have like star metal tools and stuff right now. But I didn't do anything like, uh, you know, like dungeons or anything that I felt that would be interesting to include. Wanna take a look at these guys, see if anybody else is like better. Blacksmith. So yeah, we're just stuck uh, progressing even uh, further here. I'm just gonna go straight to where I wanna throw down this wheel of pain. Is up here. Like right over here. All right, so she's got my goodies. Okay, so like. Put it right here. Boom. So we got a wheel of pain. All right, she's in there. And I just have to uh, get some stone and some wood. A little bit of plant fiber and seeds to make some gruel. This guy wants to uh, hang out. All right, she got level twenty. What what'd she get? That's really that's really garbage for a bear. I then that's that's too bad. She's max level. Let's see her stats. Uh, plus, th I mean, she got plus five, plus three, and plus three health. That's that's not that bad. But and that other bear that I had on my other playthrough, this that I uh, that I did in my own time, like. This horse been eating gruel. It's not very cool. I didn't think it would have that. Can they eat gruel? That's not one of its foods. That's weird. We'll put gruel on her now. Hmm. 
Hmm. I might just hold on to it. She's gonna burn through it really fast. Anyways. Oh, let's get a campfire. I just need some stone. Looks like I didn't get any stone yet. So some stone. Boom. Okay. Campfire. So thrall's going. All right. Let's just check out if there's any, if there are any other decent NPCs around here. This is like the best place to get uh, named thralls, especially in single player. Here we go. Uh, because you can just leave the area. And uh, they will spawn new thralls in. You don't gotta kill everybody. Like if I go into the wine cellar, which I should do, I'm gonna do that now, actually. Go into the wine cellar, and try to get uh, Zest Truncheon. Okay, these are just, uh, there's some, yep, there's some thralls there. NPCs, uh, there's a one that spawns right there. Let's see here, one right here. Okay, usually an al yeah, alchemist. There is, where's the other one? Right here, right over here. Just wanna bump anybody. Okay, that's a dancer. Looks then they'll get all, they'll get all butt hurt. I really need a blacksmith, I need a named blacksmith. Okay, nobody is named up here. That's a bummer. Okay, I'm gonna take some damage, it's all right. So we're gonna go into uh, the wine cellar and try to get Zeth's tr truncheon. That's gonna reset everybody up here. A cook that's over there was this a couple guys over here too. No. Nobody cool. Okay, so we're gonna go in here and that's gonna reset them. Take this loser out. And he didn't drop at that time, that stinks. So I'll take that steel. Some free steel. And there's a couple of the Relic Hunter Treasure Seekers. I'm gonna grab one of these guys. That's an archer. Take him on. The archer should be really easy to take down. Alright, they're both archers? That sucks. I don't want archers. Pick their steel. Might be, uh, there's some down here too. I could just pull like one of them. I just want to grab one. Because these guys are like the best, best fighters in the game now. Okay. It's like, yeah, what well, this dude, this dude wants to come up and hang out. I'm cool with that. This bro. Kind of tanky. Remember, you can take some hits from. I guess we're gonna grab this guy. Okay, whatever. Yeah, he's going down. Also, I don't care if those archers hit me. Whatever. Doesn't matter. It used to be Beastmaster Tamos. He was like the bomb. He was like the best one to get. 
because of how much health he increased per a point in vitality, but now they totally he's totally nerfed. He sucks now. He's totally garbage. These relic, relic hunter treasure seekers are like the best ones now. And I have it on four times uh, thrall. Or four, I have four times XP from killing, which means my thralls should level four times as fast. So they're like a slow leveling uh, f fighting thrall, but with four times XP, they should level up like pretty fast. Never knew about this area. Learned something new. All right, cool, man. Learned something new. So even though it's it's kind of buggy once you like get out of a dungeon with a thrall, look at these guys just like spawn back in. But uh, yeah, that's the wine cellar dungeon. There's a bunch of relic hunter treasure seekers down there. Okay, blacksmith and uh, bl just regular blacksmith that stinks. So even though like I do have this thrall on me, even though it kind of looks all weird. Okay, he's in there now. How's this girl doing on HP? It's still working out. Alright. Okay, let's get on the horse and see if anybody new came in. If not, I'll just get another Relic Hunter Treasure Seeker. So at least have like a full wheel of pain then. I just don't want to bump anybody. Armor 3. So there are, yeah, there are two blacksmiths right here and there are two blacksmiths down there. And I do, I need a named blacksmith. Preferably like a bladesmith. I think they give you the highest damage. There's a okay, armor three right there. There's an alchemist here, not uh, tier one. And uh one over here. And I think it's a dancer spawn. That was a dancer last time. I'm gonna say that's a dancer spawn. Let's get our buff buffs going again. Hey, what are you? Get a couple of cooks, don't care. There's actually, there's a bearer over there too. We'll check if the, uh, you can get like a named bearer. That would be amazing. Even like a tier three bearer. I'll take it because uh, the one that I have kind of, kind of sucks. I'm just got 10k HP, which is really good, but it could be better. Okay. Is that alchemist one? Was this bear two? All right, whatever. And these losers are all... There's like thugs or whatever, they'll try to get you, but whatever. I'm just gonna get out of here. Go back down here. Try to get that truncheon. Take out this loser. Come on, that's truncheon. Could probably hit, eh, probably still hit pretty hard, but, man, didn't get it again. Man, let's check uh, if we got some, what we got here. Fighters? I think there's two fighters, alright. Well, I don't, I, don't, I don't want it to be all dark, so we'll, like, fight them over here. Actually, I want the chick. Yeah. Let's knock her off. That dude can wail on my thralls, I don't care. Wail on yet. Just actually, eh. I'll just pay attention to that horse. He's doing bleed damage to him, but it should be. Eh, he's gonna do like a bunch of bleed damage. I should probably do something about that. Yeah. Yeah, dude, you can't just like sit there and whack my horse. So just got totally destroyed. There we go. Let's get out of here. Yeah, horse kind of took a beating. It's all right. I think I can. Yeah, I can have my torch up. All right, she's almost knocked out. All right, will this guy drop anything cool? No. All right. All right. Well, come with me. Return to surface. 
just gotta make sure when you do that like if you do this like if you go on a map if you like have a thrall and you like go through the map room or you go through like a dungeon area you just uh, make sure that you don't drop the thrall because who knows where they're freaking end up it could be kind of weird okay who's gonna spawn in here anybody good spawning anybody good no no On the real wheel of pain. Yeah, let's check one more time. What do we got here armor one, blacksmiths. I bet this is this a, if this is a dan yeah it's a dancer spawn so this is a dancer don't care about that I'm just let me know I don't need to check that anymore the alchemist armor smelter blacksmith cook and smelter. Check over here. So that's an alchemist spawn. There's our bearer tier one. Don't care. All right, let's go out this way. We'll go check some spawn locations. Some thralls over this way. Oh, these ones are eh. Crap. We'll go check up there. Let's check this spot. Tanner. He's walking around over here. Tanner. Cook. Another cook. Smith. Some name thralls, come on. I think this is a smelter and don't bump them. Alright. Yeah, smelter and tanner spawn right there. Some more al alchemists. I don't really. Yeah, it's just basic bro alchemists. We got over here. Carpenters. Tanner. Carpenter. Right, nobody's named, that's lame. Two cooks over there, I don't care about a named cook. There's an alchemist back here. Nope. There's a couple more over here too, like up here. What do we got? Nobody. And there's like these thugs or whatever that try to go after you. Let's get out of here. We should have reset. We should have gone far enough away though that it reset these uh, guys over here. Oh, that's still that tier one bear, but guarantee back here though they should be different. Yeah, they should be different. Armor and cook. Nope. That's still chasing me. Ten. Is there blacksmiths? Nobody. Nobody. Ooh, 
that was close. What do we got here? No, that really doesn't look like a named. No. Dang, man, nobody's named. It stinks. Oh, let's go in here one more time because I do want to start grabbing Silverstone. Hopefully, this guy drops his truncheon this time. Drop it. No. What a bomb. Take that hardened steel shield, too. Okay, uh, the archer. Oh, you guys got pike, too. It's gonna be annoying. Let's just take this guy out. Actually, uh, I'm gonna get no, not, not gonna worry about him. You know, just bring this guy over this way. I'll knock him out in here. Oh, he looks like a total loser, too. He's got like the male pattern baldness thing going on. Nothing against uh, gas or going bald. But I want to want like a cool looking chick or something like that. Go after my throw. Carpenter 3, Blacksmith 2, Carpenter 1, just basic Blacksmith. Lame. Alrighty, so we got a uh, wheel paints full. Just want to check one more time. You know, just in this area back here, but. We check up top if anybody good spawn in. And then we'll uh get on out of here. We'll grab some silver. Please. No, nobody. Nope. Oh, I can't. I, I think I did get a little bit of corruption, so we can like just get rid of that quick. Yeah. Okay. And a bearer two. Let's go this way. Check these ones quick. Nope. Nobody. Nope. Ah, that stinks. All right, well, let's get on out of here.
Our journeyman taskmaster. Right. It's like the boss rhino over there. I don't need this bow anymore either. I might, I'm just gonna toss this, whatever. That was just to do the drag's dungeon. Some rock nose over here. Got the job on. She at full health. All right, let's throw this girl. Yeah, I'll just stop her off. If we can regen a little bit faster. Okay, this is all silverstone up here too. Silverstone there. Go over here. Yep. Yeah, put that there. And so let's hold on to the stone too. We should be get like a decent amount of stone. I'm doing this and iron too. This is like a bunch of iron stone in that mine. I don't know where that guy went. Lasting silver stone right there. Boom. Whacked him. That's like the easiest spot for silver stone. Where'd the thrall go? She like teleporting in the freaking dungeon? Where did she go? Oh. Like, I don't think they can do that. Alright, here we are. Let's get a torch out. I should have, uh, I guess I can still get some bone from those scorpions, I think. If I need to repair the torch, that's what I'm thinking. Uh, okay, not gonna go in there, not gonna bother. It's gonna give me some. I don't think it does give you bone. No, I'm pretty sure they don't. That stinks. That's not that dark. That's a bunch of iron stone in one area, so I'm gonna like whack this. And only the ones where I can get like two or three at a time. I'm gonna hold on to the crystal also. Yeah, 
Yeah, you just get, you get a lot of, of ironstone in this mine, too. I only need coal. Went back there and check for junk. Okay. Bunch of iron stone right here. That's a lot. This is uh, that's iron stone as well. Right. Just trying to think, like, what can I make room for here? This on the I could put all the stone on the horse, maybe. Yeah. Let's get like ten K iron stone from this. Cause there is a there's a boatload over here. All the silver over here. Still some over here. even paying attention to that. Okay, where's our thrall? Where the heck did she go? Oh.
that's like kind of annoying. Come on. You can, like stand on top of it. There we go. Nice. Alright. That's good. Something. What's this? Iron stone. Whatever. Let's keep going. Alright. Let's head down this way. Now, I'm not gonna do this boss because, uh. Nah, no, this didn't take too long. It's gonna be annoying. It's definitely doable, but. I just don't really feel like doing it. There's like a regular scorpion boss that's down here, and then there's the uh, that like scorpion queen one. I'm just down here for all the silver stone. Yeah, there's like the regular scorpion boss right there. You can just like get. Uh, I don't want to. I don't want to go too close over there because I don't really feel like dealing with them. Just the uh, little like small ones, yeah. Seven hundred something silver stone. All right. Still some more down here. Some over here. I think there's some back there too. So we get 760. It's like not too bad. Definitely gotten more before, but it's alright. Uh, peace out, dude. I'm gonna go around her. Bonk. Scorpion Queen Venom. See ya. Oh, come on now. Freaking stuck in these losers. Yeah, get out of my way. There we go. No, I'm sending. Nah. I'm gonna do repair on this pickaxe right now. Oh, for real? It's too low level for star metal? Alright, well, rip. Dang, that's lame. I did not, I didn't realize that. Wow. Well, I'm a noob. I thought I could use those master or whatever repair kits on that. What a noob. I'm gonna have to go back then. That stinks. Let's do some more up here. 
If we're gonna go back, then I'm gonna go check on the those thralls are in that wheel of pain. See if there's anything else. Any uh, other ones over at the city? Dang, I should have just brought star metal and shaped wood then to repair this pickaxe. Ah, that's all good, whatever. It's not the end of the world. Let's go back and like drop a bunch of crap off and then go out to the uh, volcano. Dancer. Nobody. Alchemist. Blacksmith. Check over this way. Somebody walking around back here. It's a tanner. Right? Check up this way. Still pushing. I can't see the name. All right. Shake it out. It's nobody. Nope. That was a bummer. That's uh, one more time. Let's go see if we can get this truncheon. Or dip out of here. time all these guys let them spawn in oh. 
They're all just floating around at us. like one more over here. Nope. Dang, that stinks. That stinks. Oops. Well, I need some bone anyway to repair this uh, torch, so might as well just take these guys out. through this way. So I didn't even check if those gut thralls were like done yet. Okay, there's like yeah, there's usually a couple right here now. And there's that bear spawn. I just want to check that quick. What's this? Tier two bear, don't care. Get out of here. Alchemist. Doesn't look like anybody. All right. That stinks. Well, we're leaving. Need that map room. Go hit up the uh, volcano next. Shouldn't be that long. This would be like five minutes probably getting back. It's not going to be that long. Maybe you know, less than that. Need a better like uh, I want that the uh, the scout saddle. It's like way better on stamina for this for horses. Have the scout saddle. And it looks a lot cooler than the uh, freaking basic bro saddle that it has on right now.
So I'm wondering, like, it'd probably be smart to do the, uh, to do the volcano and then do the, um, then do the frost giant, like, dungeon after that. I'm gonna be near, I'm, like, gonna be pretty n near there anyway. We just, like, do both of those. And I'm done with. Or, I mean, I could do the volcano and then uh get them and then once I get enough gold stone, you know, come back, make the alchemical base, I need to make a map room and then just teleport up there to the to the frost dungeon. Oh no. I think I like that. I I think I like that better. I'm not trying to do like so many things all at once. Let's do that. Do the gold do the gold stone. And then, uh, get back, make the map room, and then just teleport. Oh, I'm gonna get hit by arrow. It's gonna knock me off the source. Alright, we're good. Yeah, because that way I can just, like, teleport. I mean, I could even bring down a... Uh, I, mean, I could, like, just craft another map room, too, and set it up there. Because that's, like, a good spot to have a map room at. CCG. Glad to see you back at it. Took me three days to watch the last stream. All right, man. At least you, 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 at least you got it. That's awesome, dude. You watched it. That's awesome. Really cool. I'm gonna go get some. Uh, I'm gonna go visit the uh, volcano. Cause I gotta get some gold stone. We gotta start making an alchemical base. I could go around and just try to, and try to just try to hope that tier three bears, you know, drop alchemical base, but. That's a, that's a, like an I don't know that's relying on RNG I think too much I think it's just a better call just to go up to the volcano and uh and do it yourself just go up there mine a bunch of goldstone and get out of there yeah there's a base so it didn't take that long to get back. Everybody's got a bunch of junk, so let's just tell them to get over here first. I'll just split this up. Just have these start going. It's kind of a mess too, but whatever. It's figure I'll, I'll do the sorting out later. Okay, what do we got in here? Three. Well, I split this one and then split this one. That should be no. It's a three thousand each. Oh, oh. And just split this one. Okay, cool. So some more iron. Can keep going in there. I haven't upgraded my. I haven't upgraded these yet. 1600. I don't think that's the same. Oh, that's like the same. All right, cool. Boom. Get the gruel on her. And we'll split the silver stone in half. Boom. What did the horse have? Uh, some of this junk. Nope. Didn't want to do that. Okay. Out of that. I'm just gonna throw these in here. The staff and the eye. Just throw this uh, demon blood in here. You got a bunch of demon blood. Yeah, I've like I'm ready to go on to make two map rooms. Uh, what else here? Okay, I just gotta drop junk off. So 
I'm gonna keep this ice on me. Keep this on me, the fire water. Oh, the horse. What else does the horse have? Nothing. Okay. What? I thought I put all uh, that. I had like spiced haunch in here. Um, I think the horse actually like. Oh man, I, I didn't know they eat foods. I guess I didn't realize they eat foods that they don't even. You know, that aren't on their, uh, you know, like, whatever. I think it ate it. Sucks. So I gotta make more. I have this manling bench. I'll throw this, uh, shield in there. Okay, a bunch of junk. Throw this in here. It's like inventory management stuff. Uh, throw those in there. Throw the steel in here. He has abysmal fangs. Put here. Did some off camera farming of, uh, yeah, I got like rhino hide and elephant hide crap. Yeah, I want, it, I want the, the ice, fire water. I think I just need to, uh, make some spice quick, which is from seeds. Uh, where's all my seeds? Just gotta crush some seeds quick. Five of these sounds good. And I'm making this for so that we go through the snow, I don't like end up freezing to death. What's the horse got? Nothing. Okay, it's cleaned out. So is this. Okay, good. I got what I need. Some fire water, some spice haunch. Hopefully those uh, the frost giant dudes, eh? They could. They they sometimes drop uh drop spiced uh, tea. Which is like a really good uh, warming, whatever, one to have. I just haven't gone up and learned the uh, recipe at the Mounds of the Dead yet. Because it doesn't give you like a hangover or anything like that. Okay, those should be good. Let's just uh, repair these two. Okay, we didn't get one. We didn't. That dude didn't drop one of his truncheon, truncheons. It's lame. I'm going to repair this too. junk all right we're ready to go oh, okay let's do this thing so uh, this should be kind of a journey but it'll be worth it So I'm gonna go in. The side that I'm gonna go into the volcano is the side that is like closest to the obelisk. That's like usually where I go in when I'm gonna get gold stone up there. It's usually a, a pretty good area to start at.
And that'll just make it so that we can get a bunch of alchemical base, which opens up a lot of, like, endgame uh, re crafting recipes for you. I guess on my own time. I mean, I, I could have just stuff, tried to farm bears. You know, like, tier 3 bears. Just do, uh, camps that have them. Just, like, leave the area, let them spawn back in, and... Just hope they drop some alchemical base. That'd be like a decent way. To, I don't know, doing it. I guess maybe not. I did not know what I'm doing. It. I'm, I need to pay attention here. I did not. Nope, did not go a smart way through here. Yeah, I should have gone. I should have gone past like the summoning place, but I don't know. It's not the end of the world. I'm just going to do an entire tour of the exiled lands, getting up to this place. This camp's kind of interesting. It's all skeletons. When I first played Conan Exiles, I was in a clan that set up a base like right up here. That was the first base spot that I ever had. So like cut through the savannah kind of or go along the edge of it we gotta go this way big old crocodile right there when they first started introducing uh what's up richard andes feel sorry for your thrall having to run in and keep up with you yep yeah dude yep She's doing it. But that, uh, so when they first started adding legendary items to the game, you know, all those, like, uh, the croc there, and there's a spider and stuff like that, you, you, what you used to do is you'd set up, like, a big, like, a big spike wall, and they'd aggro on you, can just, and you could just have them, like, uh, they would just basically kill themselves on the spike wall. You have to repair it every once in a while, but that was, uh, kind of an inter interesting way of getting legendary weapons. Pretty sure you can't do that anymore. Yeah, it's kind of funny. They'll just like teleport back to me every once in a while. Yeah, I don't care about any of these guys. When I was farming uh, elephants for elephant hide, I just, uh, I really, I just um, use, a, even though I'm not specced into agility at all, I just do daggers with them and just stack 20, like 20 stacks of bleed on them. Uh, that seems to be like, I don't know, one of the fastest way of um, getting those things down. The rhinos, rhinos are, I just use my strength build uh, sword and uh, throwing axe combo on those guys. They go down pretty quick. But the, the elephants, I just think, I mean, from what I was doing, like, I think just stacking bleed was an easier way of killing those things rather than actually, like, hitting it with my strength build weapons. This is the way that I go to get to the... Uh, to get into like the north usually. Just go th right through here.
I'm gonna do is well, I'm gonna stop and I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get a bunch of this Asura's glory. This is like really good for horses. This is like the highest uh, HP that it gives you for your horses. Just gonna kill that guy. He would have been bothering me. Yeah, I'm just gonna farm a bunch of this stuff real quick. It's like a thousand of it. There's a bunch of it right here. So yeah, this is like the best, um, the best one for your horse. Once you get to like level 20, this will give him the most uh, HP per tick or whatever. Let's just farm a bunch of it. Farm like a thousand of it. So I'm pretty sure it's just a thousand per stack, so I might as well just keep a thousand on him. Right? It is a thousand, right? Yeah, okay, cool. Yep. Can just uh, get rid of all that other junk that I don't need. Boom. Alright, there it is, yep. Does it say? I think it says, maybe not. Yeah, 10 points of healing every second. That's like the best out of any one of them. Okay, we're gonna head east. <laughs> Basically, gonna head the way that you get to the to get like those black flood tools. Uh, that's where I'm gonna go towards. I think I should be able to go up this way, yep. Yeah. Okay, I might just need to like climb up here a little bit. I should be good after this one though. Come on now. There we go. Just like a little shortcut. I gotta. Let me just get like my stamina back. I, I could have gone like all the way around. But I'm just gonna climb up here. It shouldn't be that much of a detour. I mean, it shouldn't take that long. I just gotta climb a little bit. We should be good. Yep. Okay, so this one. Oh, oh come on now. Get all the way up here. And we're good. It's a bunch of iron stone over this way too, like all of, all over there. Have a bunch of yeah, I got a bunch of ice, so it should be fine in the volcano. Didn't be uh, overheating or anything. So it's very cold up here. I mean, you just hit like that spice haunch and uh, fire water. I'm just, uh, I think I'll just need to take one. But I don't want to take uh, a lot of damage. I don't know, maybe I could just uh, run right through it, you know? But I don't know. I'm not going to chance it. As soon as it says extremely cold, that's when I'm gonna hit it. Which should be up here. Yeah. Fire water, spiced haunch.
just so I can get to the entrance of the volcano, which is like pretty close. This uh, dragon chasings. I think it's like right ahead. What's up, Hitnox? Hey, Warrior, finally caught a live stream. Nice, man. Awesome. Glad you could make it. That should be the entrance right there. Alright, before we go in here, I'm going to change their follow distance to uh, the lowest. Okay, headache. What's the headache debuff anyway? Maximum stamina reduced by 50. Alright, whatever. It's fine. Alright, cool. So we're on the volcano. We're in here. I'm immediately just going to hit some ice. It's a tune. A tune to the obelisk down here. And let's get our uh, yep, favor of Yog buff back. Okay, so I uh, got a bracelet now. Good. I just. Uh, Get some water going. Gonna have to fight these losers right here, but these should be the only aggressive thralls, like or aggressive NPCs on like this set. I never knew about the uh, throwing axe and sword combination. That's my go-to combo for now. It's awesome, man. Yep, it's really good, dude. I really like it. Who's this guy? Oh, some archer guy. Yeah. Is this a... okay. The last time I was up here, that was a, uh, that was like a skull rock nose, and that thing was freaking tough. Okay, this guy I want to kill him. Okay, got that douche. And these, these fighters, they, the, the volcano ones, they, they hit kind of hard. But not like, not anything crazy. Alright, so this is down. And, oh, wait, was it, uh, I don't know, okay, extremely hot, alright, so we gotta hit ice again, got plenty of ice though, so, we're good, I just missed some obsidian down here, so first area we're gonna check is like down here, can I hit multiple ones, yeah, I think that's a rock nose on us, This is just like a basic bro one. Alright, good. What the hell was that? Alright, he just went flying. Okay, we're encumbered. Now I'm only gonna take like a thousand of city. I don't need that much. And then I'll keep some raw ash. Maybe like 500 raw ash and I'll keep the crystal too. And, uh, eh, I'll just drop stone. Yeah, and some specific scene right here, too. Okay. As long as I have ice, I, uh, I'll be uh, fine up here. And I got plenty of ice on me. Basically, the the rest of these NPCs I'm gonna run into, they're not gonna be uh, hostile, so I don't gotta worry about freaking dealing with them. Uh, it's gonna be dark though, which is kind of annoying. So goldstone is definitely uh, I don't know. Compared to like when you're mining silverstone, you definitely get a lot less when you're whacking obsidian. I'm just gonna go up this way. Uh, extremely hot, so I'm, I'm losing HP. I'm not gonna hit some ice. Yeah, maybe I should. Yeah. Alright. And yeah, we'll cool down. We'll be fine. 
There's some, uh, sometimes there's like name thralls up here, and they're pretty easy to go after because they're not aggressive, you know, they don't like mob you immediately. I'll check when, uh, after we're mining this, let's see. It's just kind of hard to see since it's dark. There it is. I just hope I don't run into one of those skull freaking rock noses because that thing was a pain in the ass. I ended up just running away from the dumb thing. It was a freaking bullet sponge. Need raw ash for some recipes, so I'll keep that. I don't even think I'm gonna check those thralls. I, I wouldn't. Uh, I'm not here to like get thralls anyway. I mean, maybe I could. I got a leather bind. I got like the good bindings. Okay, let's keep going. Let's check them out quick. Let's go back. Let's check out. Check out who's freaking hanging out down here. Fighter. Sorcerer 2, Cook. Sorcerer 3, freaking nobody. Bunch of bums. Okay, it's very hot, so we don't need to worry about it. Hint getting any ice yet. Man, out of all that, didn't even get one. Didn't get any gold stone out of that. It's frustrating. There we go. It's just very hot. I should have brought. A, I, I didn't have. I haven't crafted a sandstorm mask because there's one spot that has. Uh, it's like a toxic area, but it does have some obsidian there too. But I just. Uh, I forgot to to craft one. Oh, here we go. All right. That guy kind of freaking jump scared me a little bit. Yeah, so we just hit the ice. Bro is hanging out here. I gotta follow distance on lowest to look on what's going on here. So we're going on this way. Anybody? No. Nope. Okay, we're gonna go over here and then and then backtrack and go that down that way.
It is really, it is pretty frustrating how little goldstone you get from whacking this stuff. I do it like a, I don't know, comparison of if, if hitting it with a pick, with a regular pick, makes a difference. Cause I always just use my pickaxe. Let's go back. Some steep stairs. There's uh, some down. Okay, we're gonna just jump down here. Jump down here. There's a bunch down this way, and then we'll come back up and go over there. Can't remember if they're hostile down here or not. I'm just gonna assume that they are. Oh, well, they're not. Alright. Oh, cool. Who's this bro? The merchant? Alright. Could have been whacking that one too. It's alright. Okay, that's as far as I'm going to go that way. I could uh, get on the horse and make this a little bit faster. This way now. And these guys are cool. 
Just those dudes in there, those are all hostile, so I'm just gonna like avoid those guys. Let's go down this way. I don't even know if I have my enough durability to get through this entire place. I think I should. It's gonna be. Yeah, I think it's it's it, it's gonna be like near broken. She's cool. Nothing that way. Alright, these guys. Actually, right here, I'm going to tell them to stop. Stop following me. Because I don't, I don't trust this. I already took a little bit of damage. I don't, I don't trust them. I'll just come back. I'll come back there for them. With all the lava around and crap, I'm just not gonna deal with that. So, man, I don't know, I gotta, I gotta test it all. See if you get more from a, with a regular pick than the pickaxe. I can't remember. Because I always just use the pickaxe. But I feel like I've gotten more before. It might be because I was using a pick. You definitely want to be as like efficient as possible when you go, because you gotta go all the way up to the freaking volcano. You don't wanna have to come up here all the time, you know? Nah, I'm pretty sure my pick pickaxe durability is gonna run out. Not even gonna finish this entire thing. There's still obsidian over there. like the clumped clustered ones because if my pickaxe breaks I want to make sure I'm like being efficient as possible here 
It's going. It's going to pretty soon here. Probably like during this one. Yeah, there we go. There it goes. That sucks. Well, rip. I almost got the entire area. Not a big deal. Oh, I definitely don't want to eat that. It sucks. That was a waste. used to be like if you touched that lava you were like dead so I'm glad they uh, changed that but I'm gonna real quick do that I'm th one sec uh, text the GF quick Just go like the same way that it came in. Let's go back that way. Did I not tell them to follow me? I don't think I told them to follow me. What an idiot. I was like, no wonder. It's like, what's going on? They're freaking following me. Oops. Man. That was pretty dumb. Alright. Yep. Okay, 264. That's pretty garbage, to be honest. But I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this again with like a regular star metal pick and see if that gets more. Than the pickaxe. I can't remember. I wanted to at least get like a thousand alchemical base going. Oh, extremely hot, right? So I can't climb. Can't climb like that. This is just like basic bro medium armor. I mean, it was crafted by my uh, tier four guy, but it wasn't like, you know, it's not like the epic version. So as long as you just bring ice with you up to the volcano, you should be good. And all this, uh, man, all that obsidian respawn, I got to know that for next time. I'll do that on my, like, on my own time. But like when I do this run up here, I'll bring like some star metal to freaking star metal and shaped wood to repair that. So we can just get a boatload. 
Let's get a boatload of freaking goldstone. Who's chasing me here? This guy. What? I said I didn't like that. Damn. Dude, they're super pissed. Why are they so pissed? Must have, must have been their friend or something, man. Why are they going after me? I didn't hit anybody. Bunch of jerks. Getting out of here. Fucking deuces. If I get out of here fast enough, I should be able to, uh, like, not have to hit any, whatever, firewater, spice haunch, or whatever crap that I have on me. It's gonna go to extremely cold. I'm gonna start taking damage, but I think I should get out of here fast enough to where it, like, won't matter. Yeah, it's extremely cold over here. I mean, I got a glut for punishment, so I should be uh, regening like relatively fast. Nah, I think I'll be fine. Wiki says the harvesting for pickaxe is ten. Star metal pickaxe is 14. I have a star metal. I have star metal pickaxe, dude. Do you mean like a regular star metal pick? Because I was using the pick, the star metal pickaxe. Let's go back like a little different way. We'll go back this way. All the way down this mountain. I think there are horses around here. Yeah, there's a couple up there. You can get horses from like this area. hanging out over here. Missed. What's that? What's that white one? It's a skull. Skull bro. Oh, we were all so long that our stamina buff went away. Sound metal pick is 14. You mean like, okay, is a, is a star metal pickaxe 14 too? 
Or did you mean that the star metal pick is 10 and the star metal... I mean the star metal pickaxe is 10 and the star metal pick is 14. So I don't really need that extra stamina right now. I can just wait till we're off of the off of the horse. Oh, you missed, kitty. Yeah, uh, saw that coming. I think I need to get, I don't know, I think I need to get fur. I can't remember if I, I don't think I did that on my own time. So I might need to take a trip to the jungle. Cause that's like the easiest place to get fur is from all those gorillas. Let me check out the summoning place though. Totally wreck all these noobs. All these freaking noob NPCs. Alright, let's get our buffs back. Alright, who else is here? I know we got archers. This isn't even gonna be fair. Gonna be all dark too. It's annoying. Here, let's put the torch on them. Who's this bro? It's a basic fighter. See ya. Archers. All right, please. Check on your thralls. Thralls are good, dude. Okay, we getting anybody uh, named? I don't see anybody. Get your shield out. Fucking loser. Anybody? I don't see anybody. No.
to shoot me too. Alright, they're coming around. Eh, no, nobody. There should be a like sorcerer up here, maybe. Yeah, this guy. Sorcerer three. Right. Who's this guy? Carpenter. Totally wrecked. What does this guy have? You got a sorcerer's spell page? No. Dead sorcerer's map. Gotta check if anybody good. Nice no, cook. Medicine Man 2. Nice cannon group. Yeah, whatever, dude. Crippled me. What a jerk. See ya. Yeah, I just slaughtered him, dude. They're, they're, they're low level garbage freaking NPCs in there, so. Alright, we're gonna check, uh. Let's check Sinner's Refuge and then we'll get, we'll get, uh, get on back. I couldn't remember if that was just, uh, you know, guys talking. Or if it's uh, if you learn a recipe, but yeah, obviously just talks a lot. Some of the lore or whatever. Some of the lore is okay. If I have any bunny on this on this wheel, I don't think I do. Let's check it out. Oh, I do. I got. Oh yeah, that's right. I got a name sorcerer earlier when I was like doing it on my own time. That's pretty sweet. Heck yeah, name sorcerer. That's pretty cool. Let's go check this area out. Should we just like one shot these guys? These are like the weakest NPCs in the game though, so. Yeah, it's nothing special. Cook and Tanner. See ya. Okay, got that that guy's a name to somebody. What is he? A guardian? Yeah, whatever. Don't care. Alright.
the horse have anything? Oh yeah, I got the uh, name, name sorcery. So we can uh, switch this guy out. Uh, I'll just like leave this dude in here. Hanging out. Uh, I got a failed source of spell here, just like inventory management time. Alright, all I'm on all that silver bar. There we go. All the silver bar. Take a ton of silver coins. Yeah, that gold stone. Let's melt that down. Take all this junk. I'll probably just put the obsidian here for now. And I can, uh, I'll just leave like this ash, I think, in here. Crystal stone here. Want one of these. I don't need a steak on me anymore. Boom. I do still need these th these. Don't need the ice anymore. I think I grabbed everything off for you. Yep. I should make, uh, let's see, let's get our stuff repaired. Alright. So that made that all into a gold bar. That's good. That's gonna keep crafting. Need to make another, I wanna make another grinder. Oh, that's in crafting stations in general. I think it's, what is it, 50 and 10? All right. gonna put this one right here. That'll be for gold. Gold coins. Okay, this one. It's for silver. Okay, so I get this ready. First thing about me, we gotta make a map map room. Oh, okay, it's got a craft. All right, not really sure. Uh, yeah, this thing like the casting table. Oh, I like stop sometimes. It's kind of annoying. I'll let that just do its thing. I gotta check if I got fur or not. I don't think I did. Nope, I didn't. Oh, it sucks. Oh, man. That freaking sucks. Got a bunch of iron bar, though, which is good. I think I'll just like leave it in here for now. A bunch more steel. And hardened steel. It's 5,000 iron for 1,000 steel. So 
so I don't wanna make I wanna make two hundred I wanna make five hundred. So that should be twenty five hundred for five hundred. Okay, let's get some more. That's like, and maybe like 500 more reinforcements. All right, cool. So we got our uh, gold, gold coins. Like, look at, like, I don't know what is going on here. It's like the one arm out thing. We can floating around. It's being weird. Yeah, it like stops. I don't know why it does that. It's just weird. Yeah, it like stopped again. Huh, I don't It's gonna take a little bit to crush. All right, let's uh, let's go get some fur. I can uh, just leave these in here for now. Oh, and I, I killed this uh, corrupted crocodile and like, dropped a ton of potion of bestial memories. It's pretty sweet. I was like really lucky. Those are, uh, I mean, they're not that hard to make, but it dropped like a ton of them. So I was like, heck yeah, man, I'm freaking running that back to the base. Put it in the preservation box. Heck yeah. Hey, is there anything else on this guy? No. Alright, might as well just start, start making some. So we'll have some when we get back. That's fine. Nobody, nobody decent over there. See, so yeah, I think I think taking out gorillas is like the easiest way to get fur in the game. And it shouldn't be that. Oh, should be that far to get there.
That's funny. I didn't even visit that place yet. I'm just gonna cut through this camp. Oh, so we got a, uh, an event going on. Nah, I don't really care about doing this right now. Dang. Oh, there it is. I didn't even notice that. Looks like a corrupted shale back over there. It's like a couple of them, I think. Looks like a corrupted guy too. Yeah. All right, let's go. Another corrupted boy. A big mad. I can take some hits here. Half of my damage is being split between my uh, thralls. But I'm just gonna get low hand. There we go. Those two shale backs only got 116 beam blood. That's pretty garbage. That's like, I don't know. That's like a shale back boss over here. I think that's him. Yeah, this boy. Oh, that's kitty. Oh, you missed. So, looks like like a one skull one, yeah.
I don't even know how hard this guy hits. Probably not very hard. Get the hell out of here, Fucking birds. Alright, here we go. Let's take this guy out. We're running into like a bunch of corrupted freaking animals. Here we go. Pick up this loser. Yeah. That's some alchemical base. That's pretty cool. We don't get from this guy. Potion of natural learning. I don't care about that. Oh man. Okay. And yeah, we're good. Thought it looked like a uh, one star. Or I mean uh the uh whatever skull the skull head. I used to come over here and get this uh what is whatever lotus crap, but since they reworked all the uh, potions and whatever, you don't even, I don't, I don't, I'm not even bother with it. It's just kind of nice. You don't need to gather all the uh, lo all the flo lotus flowers anymore if you don't want to. Yeah, we're heading over this way. That snake's gonna battle that bird over there. I don't know. We gotta go this way. This way. Yeah. Yep, alright. There's a bunch of crocodiles over here, too. Let's uh, kick some butt. This guy's pissed. Okay, let's go over the actually those crocs, I guess. Let's take them out. I'm just gonna get the uh, gorillas, I'm not gonna bother with the crocs. That's a big boy. Going down, going on down there. It sounds like a snake and something. Yeah. Right, we'll take some hits. They don't really that hard. Fall down there, you jerk. I want like f over 500. If I could leave with like 500 or something for I'd be okay with that. I don't want, I don't want him to come to me. See his health bar. There we go. Where'd that guy fall down to? There he is. What is this? Oh, a horse. Sorry. I'm 
Snake Sandals. Okay, we're gonna go up over here. Some more gorillas over this way. Almost got 500. I'm, I'm cool with that. I think there's some more up here, though. Yep. Still on the fall off the edge there. Just gave me hide, that's it. That's lame. I think that's all of them. Alright. Well, we got like 500 something. I'm cool with that. Snake's still freaking following me. What a dick. Might as well grab the obelisk that's over here, and I can like take out some sand reapers for uh, sand reaper poison. If you want a cool base spot? I used to build in this thing all the time. But it's like it's like this this area in there. It's pretty big, so you can just put like a wall in front of it. You don't gotta really, you don't gotta really use that much materials, and you can make a base out of it in there. It's pretty cool. You can fit like quite a bit of stuff in there too. It's starting to get dark. Bunch of spiders over here that I'm not gonna bother with. Okay, here's the uh, obelisk over here, and there's all uh, those sand reaper things. The upper staging area. Maybe like spiders over here too. Let's make this quick. Yeah, turn the brace. Where's this guy? Didn't get any uh, sandry thorns or whatever. Way too many spiders over here. Some. There's another. Okay, here we go. Yeah, 
Okay, here we go. Sandra Batoxin plan. You can just put like a map room on that top of that thing, call it a day. So you get a pretty good spot for it. I think that's what people usually do on servers. Okay, we got, got spider chasing. Oh, there we go. I'm on one of these guys. Oh. Stop chasing my horse. Too, that's pretty good. I know there's more of them over here. Can't really see all that well because it's dark. There we go. I still want to run into that the freaking big ass one. I think there's like a couple over here. Spiders, I don't care about those. Okay, this is like the last one. I just don't want to aggro that big ass one over there. Nice, 80. Cool with that, that's a big ass one right there. Okay, we're gonna get yeah this guy and then get out of here. Thanks. Peace out. Get out of here. Okay, I think I can just uh, go straight here. to go up this little, like, yeah, this little path up here.
I haven't been to the Black Alien yet. Ah, whatever. Just let me go buy it. It's not a big deal. I can go, go check it out another time. There's probably nothing there anyway. An old pirate ship. Just floating around. I don't know what the one arm out thing is all about. Just like half T posing, just like floating. Let's go on this way. That event's still going on over there. Dang, took some damage there. back. Oh, alright. Hold up. I always stop for uh, corrupted freaking stuff. Nice. That was, a sh that was a freaking ton of demon blood. Paid attention to the stamina. I 
let's just check on these guys. Nope, nobody. some corruption and we're good all right sweet so let's go ahead and make some of this uh, sand reaper this reaper poison so craft 80 of those what she got on her right. bunch of demon blood in here. This should all be, yep, all right, that's all ready to go. Alchemical base going. What do we got here? We got 500 more steel. Boom. Well, like, I don't need that much steel. 500 of it. We're about to get a bunch more black ice. I'll just put this in here and we'll make a bunch more hardened steel. Uh, what else we got? Okay, I know we got we have some alchemical base. Okay, 112, sweet. 112. So let's get that. Put it in here. Put these over here. I need some like hardened leather, some thick leather, probably more leather. Mm. Yeah, let's craft. Yeah, let's make like 250 more. See that stitch thing. Okay, yeah, I got fur. Other thick, uh, thick hide. So doing that all right I'm gonna just throw these in here more alchemical base all right uh, I just gotta see what I need here um now let's check in for me um Medium perfected, perfected medium padding. It's fourteen. All right. Okay, that's gonna take too long. Well, like, let's start out with sixty. the uh where is it here should have learned it I don't know if I learned it or not yeah here it is the Cambodian one so it's gonna be 30 30 uh layered fur all right and that's and I need more Alchemical base. And this we got a sandstorm. Thirty. Okay, that's doing its thing. I also need twenty seven of that silk. Yeah, twenty seven layered silk. 
Besides, need more alchemical base. That'll get there. I'm just gonna like whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm not gonna take that much damage from the sandstorm. I'm not gonna worry about it. So like, I mean, eh, I don't need to take it off yet. But I'm pretty much gonna retire this armor, and we're actually gonna get some like good armor now. What I could do is grab like half of this, half of this. And I want four weight reduction kits. Okay. That's almost done. The hardened leather is almost done. Hit okay, boom. I need reptile, that reptile hide too. Perfected medium padding. I need five. I need twine. All right. And this is gonna be like hundred. I just need more uh, hardened leather. All right. Almost got the fur. We got our scout right in here. It's good. All right, let's get uh this. And I see iron bar. Okay, that's easy enough. It's like 200. Look at that. The wrap and the gloves. One more padding. Okay, the boots. I'm not gonna put a, a, a reduction kit on it. So I'm gonna keep those. This is just like a starting set. I'm gonna try to. Uh, the, the ideal would be to have the Kari one. Kari Overseer Helm. Kari Soldier Chest. The Kari Soldier Tacit. And then the medium, and then the Silent Legion medium gauntlets. This is just like starter one. And I'm gonna do the reptile hide. Helm and chest. One of those weight reduction kits. Okay, weight reduction kits, I'm going to put on these. Um, I guess I'll like keep these in here for now. What time is it? 6.30? I got to get going pretty soon here. Alright. All right, so I'm doing this. The reason I'm doing this, so 15% strength weapon damage increase, right? Better armor, and then, uh, and then just a little bit boost to stamina. So we got stamina boost, and then we got a little uh, strength weapon damage boost. So if I go now into stats, I'm getting seven damage from item from my items, which will increase once I get a uh, better weapon. The next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna hit up the uh, frost temple so I can get the uh, frost 
Um, what is it? The uh, Black Ice Broadsword. That's what we're doing next. So we got that. And I, I really don't like how this armor looks. I, I might I might do that little uh this thing, the combined thing. The source stats with the appearance. Alright. And I think what I wanna do is I'm gonna just do like the Conan one. Where is it in here? This one. The royal this one right here. So 17, 11, I just need medium padding, which is pretty easy. Let's do four or five of these. So we're like almost at end game. We just need that, I just want that broadsword, that bright, that black ice broadsword that's gonna give us a really good damage increase and then we'll start work on like getting the uh, end game armor. So like the, uh, what is it, the um, black keep, we gotta do that. Gotta do uh, the war maker's dungeon, there we go. Where is it? It's down, it's like down more. How many? I think I need more iron. Alright. Oh, that's, that's way too much. I've never done this illusion thing yet, so let's just see how it goes. Nice, I didn't craft one of them. Did I not craft? The legs. Alright, so the appearance one goes there. The stats one goes here. Stats, appearance, stats, appearance, stats, appearance, appearance, stats. Right. So right now, 665 armor. Just with this crap, this is even, this is like not even crafted by, but that's why I need to get a tier four. Uh, yeah, I need to get bladesmith too. So this is our points, right? 20, yeah, 20 strength, 20 vitality, 10 points, 10 corrupted points into authority to get the, uh, Damage taken by you split between you and your followers, which is nice. And then the 10 points in the grit. Stats. Total damage is 103. 7 from the items. And when I saw that extra 15% or whatever from the... Uh, from these. That's pretty cool, though. Yeah, so I got the, the, the freaking cone gear on. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna end it there, guys. Uh, I might do, like, a little bit of grinding, as in, like, I, I might get more alchemical base, uh, yeah, because you always need more alchemical base, and I might do some more thrall grinding, like, I really want to get a tier 4 armor, or a um, tier 4 blacksmith would be pretty cool, but for sure, next one, we're gonna hit up, uh, some more dungeons, so, like, the black, uh, keep, and the frost temple one, frost dungeon, Gotta get that uh, black ice broadsword, and then uh, like the war maker dungeon. But um, yeah, I'm gonna end it there, dudes. So thanks for chilling, and uh, hope everybody has an excellent evening. Take it easy.